I think what theater does for society is allow us a chance to stop and kind of examine ourselves and examine our lives. And I think that's what's really interesting. I don't think theater provides answers. I think what theater does best is provide questions. Cal State Northridge offers in their BA in theater what we call a comprehensive degree. But our degree basically makes them do a little bit of everything. So you have to do acting directing, you have to do the design tech, you have to do the theater history literature. And what we find from creating this curriculum is that the students make a whole bunch of discoveries along the way about their role in theater and what their career could be in theater. Especially in a supportive environment like CSUN where we kind of encourage the students to try new things and sometimes it works and sometimes it doesn't. The classes start out with an intro to theater and then get into more specialized areas from there. They'll get the chance to explore all the different options within the theater program and then be involved in a variety of different settings in a production. They also can expect a lot of work. There is work that has to happen outside of the classroom that ultimately falls onto the responsibility of the student. It is a time consuming major in that sense. We make sure that nobody volunteers for anything, really. We want students to be getting academic credit for things, A, to help them graduate in time, B, to reinforce what they're learning in the classroom, and C, so we have a way to actually evaluate their ability and their skill. We also have internship opportunities at the junior and senior level that we can kind of associate students with an internship project in any kind of number of fields, whether it's theater or casting or uh, film production. We kind of want to get students out there to experience the workforce in some tangible way. And we also bring in a lot of guest artists throughout the year. We do master classes, but we also bring in guest directors, guest designers, and kind of create opportunities for students to talk to professionals, to talk to people who are actually doing this for a living. The degree in theater really is a degree in time management. It's built into every class that we do. The show may be important, but you also have the papers to write and the research to do and the classes to attend. We have a class that is called theater management, which is about actually managing other people, which is a whole different level of time management. We find that that sense of accountability really kind of plays into, you know, this is what employers want, isn't it? That they want people who can think on their feet, who can solve problems, and who can lead a project to completion. And we find that theater majors, because of the skills we teach them, they can go out and do that relatively easily. So it really can apply to, to any field you want. You're kind of limited by your own imagination or how you apply that. The idea that you need to continue working on your craft. You will never be done learning how to do theater. And each time you do a show, it's always starting all over again. It's something that we've been doing since the cave days. You know, we sit around the campfire and we tell stories. We're sharing stories about who we are and who we want to be. And I think that's the real power of what we teach in the theater department.